Hello, welcome to the second review for today. Um, and it is the Deluxe Generations Jihaxis. Jihaxis? Jihaxis? I don't know how it's pronounced. Um, I do like the toy. Um, it's not as much like the IDW version of the character um, as I would have liked. And I don't know if it's supposed to be IDW Jihaxis or not. Um, but I do like the figure though. Um, it's a really nice head sculpt there. Can't really make out his yellow eyes against the orange head on the camera. Um, yeah, and he is a remold of the Armada Starscream. A very drastic remold, as you'll see in a minute. Um, so, starting off, he does have a, at least on mine, it's a very tight ball joint. Um, but he does have a ball joint head. Like Starscream, his neck platform thing does move. You can angle down his shoulder cannons. Oh, darn it, gun. Guns, guns, guns. This guy has lots of guns. Um, for a scientist, anyway. His shoulders do that. They do have a hinge as well. They do have a swivel there. Elbow joint. That's your wrist moving. That's for transformation, but hey. Um, no waist joint. Legs can move up, down, and out. Um, thigh swivel, knee swivel. His feet do move. Um, these don't, unlike the Armada Starscream. Wings can wiggle. Um, since the guns come off, I'll just show you. You can have him hold his guns. Um, they can peg onto either side of the wing, or to either wing, I mean. Um, so... You can do that. He does have Minicon ports, since he's a remold of Armada Starscream. Um, doesn't do anything. Same with Armada Starscream, doesn't do Jack Diddly Squat to, to peg a Minicon onto. For those of you new kids in Transformers Armada, if a Minicon pegs onto a Transformer, it gives them new powers or weapons. I only have one Armada figure, and that's Unicron. He's in such bad shape, I don't want to show him on camera. Um... Anyway, so, oh yeah, um, I guess we'll show off the um, missiles. These are friction missiles. They're, uh -huh. I just shot knockout. We just shot knockout with that missile. I'm sorry, knockout. You scratched my paint job. There you go, missile back in. He has two of them. So yeah. Um, so size comparison, here he is next to the original version of the mold, the Generations Armada Starscream. Um, Jahaxis looks to be a little shorter, but I think that's because of the, uh, shoulder remodification they did. Because they are probably actually the same size. Um, so some differences are obviously the wing shape, the head shape, the his torso slope, Starscream, comes to a drop-off. Um, the molded detailing is different. The nose is different, obviously. Um, the legs are... Like, the uh, wings on the legs are actually different. In that Starscream's actually... Hold on. Move in and out for transformation. Jahaxis says don't. Um, also, Starscream... Um, does... I can't show you it lit up, but he has light piping. Shahaxis has painted eyes. He believes in a new uh, new robot. And apparently that new robot doesn't have light piping. Um, yeah. Get out of here, Starscream. Here he is next to the Fall of Cybertron Shockwave, his student. Now I am the master. Only a master of evil, Shockwave. We're both evil, so... It means what you mean. It means what it means. Oh, I'm full of errors today. Okay, and now he here he is with the Prime Voyager Beast Hunters Shockwave. Oh, great, Primus. He's huge. Yeah, so, uh, let's get down to his 
Transformation into vehicular mode. Take the guns. <clears throat> Take them out of his hands. First, really nice mold of detail on the guns. A, a little, I think maybe too much so. Um, don't like that the guns have that maze work. The movie Maze Runner takes place in his guns. Okay, um, jokes aside. I'm gonna take the heel spur and slide it up into his foot like that. And go his feet down. Now this is probably going to show you a mistransform because I have difficulty with this figure that I don't have a star screen. Take his nose cone, put it down, take this flap and put it up here. Push his head down into that flap so it hides in his chest. Um, and again, I don't follow the instructions. I do things my way. Put his hands in there. Angle his wings forward. Swivel his legs around. Tuck them in like so. Tuck them in like so. Mine don't usually grip very well, so I'm kind of surprised that they did now. Probably just for the camera. Gosh darn it, gun. Um, so I'll show you why mine I call mine trans mistransformed. Okay, um, oh, we're actually going to have to undo half that work we just did. Okay, um, as you'll... Let me move his legs more. Okay, you can see right there where my thumb's pointing. There's a slot, and here's a tab up here. They're supposed to go in there, and on Star Screen they do. But on Jahaxis, at least on maybe I'm doing something wrong. But uh, hold on, a new more work. Okay, um, at least on mine. So maybe I'm doing something wrong. Um, they don't line up perfectly on mine. Um, and I could be doing something wrong, but they don't line up and they don't peg in because of it. So my Asia Haxes, at least to me, looks a little mistransformed. There goes the gun again. Someone somewhere in the world is watching this and laughing. Probably a lots of someone's, actually. Um, I still really like the jet mode. I don't like that this angle's down. I mean, I don't know if it's supposed to do that, but it's probably not the most aerodynamic thing in the world. Um, oh, I forgot to show this off. His nose cone bends, and that gave away the secret. Yes, he has land landing gear. Oh, I didn't even notice. Mine has a little black streak right there. Yeah, so he has landing gear. All right, give me a second. We'll be back with a vehicle mode size comparison. So, um, here he is with the uh, star scream. Um, yeah, they're pretty much the same size. He's a little bigger and heavier, so he's probably a little slower, too, flight-wise. Um, so our screen's much more aerodynamic. Um, the Shahaxis is also a shorter jet. Shorter wingspan. So, yeah, make of it what you will. Um... Here he is with the Cybertron st uh, Shockwave, almost said Starscream. Um, longer jet, longer wings. Murder Batmobile. Whatever this is. Okay. Um, yeah, so now we'll put him back in robot mode for the end of the video. So, yeah. Um, I really do like this figure, um, and I didn't mention this in Windblade, but if you see Windblade, definitely pick her up, um, and if you see Jahaxis, pick him up as well, he's really cool, I really do like Jahaxis, I really do like Jahaxis and Windblade. Um, one thing I forgot earlier, you can, um, um, I know you can, I've seen people do it, just that hard, really? <laughs> okay, I don't want to break this thing so I'm not gonna try it but the box shows him with his nose bent uh, into his chest like up in here filling the gap that forms when you have it normally but I don't want to break my toy and I feel like it's not supposed to do that um, but yeah oh he's really cool Jaxus Windblade pick them up if you see them either one you don't have to get both um, I did and I did not even mean to get both but I was looking for Leader Jeff Fire and didn't find him, but I found these two. 
Um, yeah, so we'll see you next time.